will be going over how to properly use a vacuum pump. The vacuum pump is used for vacuum filtration or vacuum evaporation. Whenever we use a vacuum pump, we always need to make sure we use a vacuum trap. A vacuum trap is used to trap toxic or corrosive chemicals and vapors to protect the vacuum pump. We will be using a filter flask as our trap. Let's get started. Materials needed include support stands, vacuum pump, two filter flasks, three vacuum hoses, one hole stopper with hose outlet, and one beaker or flask. First, ensure the vacuum pump is seated firmly on the bench top and there is enough room around it to work. Check the vacuum lines for any cuts or breaks. Clamp both of your filter flask to support stands or a fume hood frame. Connect the vacuum hose between the arms of the filter flask. Fit the one hole stopper with the hose outlet to the filter flask closest to the vacuum pump. Connect the vacuum hose from the one hole stopper hose outlet to the vacuum pump inlet. Connect the vacuum hose to the vacuum pump outlet and ensure it is facing towards the back of the fume hood or into a secondary container if not inside a fume hood. This is to trap any chemicals or vapors that are potentially inside the vacuum pump. Turn on the vacuum pump and test the vacuum pump by putting your hand over the top of the open filter flask. When you are finished using the vacuum pump, Disconnect the hose between your filter flask and the trap before turning the vacuum off. This is to prevent any unwanted chemicals and vapors from returning to the filter flask from the negative pressure in the system. Disconnect the vacuum hoses from the trap and empty the contents of the trap into a waste container. <laughs> 